Hi, I've decided to do a what's in my bag video because it seems to be a good start for people that are, I suppose, trying to get into the whole YouTube thing. And so here's mine. Um, I'm not going to ramble because that's just what I do, so I apologise in advance. But anyway, here's my current bag. I usually wear it sort of all the way over like this. Um, I'm actually going to get a new one quite soon. Um, it's actually coming tomorrow, hopefully, but I'll show you that when it arrives. But this bag is kind of cute. I bought it on a whim. I was walking through the um, local plaza, and there's a place in Australia called Suzanne. It's actually more or less for the older lady, but they sometimes have some nice stuff, and I saw this, and it was, I think it was $30 or $40, so that's, you know, 20 25 US dollars, so it wasn't too bad. It's got lots of little zippery bits, which is good, because I'm, I like to carry a lot of stuff. But we'll go through the main compartment to start with. Sunglasses. They're Ray-Bans, but they're not Wayfarers. I actually had some gla glasses that looked quite similar to this that were a no-name, and they lasted for years. I bought them in New York in um, 2005, and they broke last year. So I wanted some that looked similar, and it just happened that Ray-Ban had some, and I quite like those. And hopefully I won't break them for a long time. Tissues. Exciting phone, my iPhone 3GS, this is my second, um, I broke my first one, but I got a replacement, it's got a gold cover on it, it's a little bit gross and scratched, but I love it, and hopefully I won't break it for a while, I don't know if you can see that, no, not really, but that's, that's Mike Patton, and if you don't know who Mike Patton is, I suggest you Google him right now. Headphones, um, I've actually got Bose headphones, I only got these a few weeks ago, had a gift voucher and I decided this is what I wanted to buy. They're around ear ones. I feel like a bit of a douche when I wear them, but I prefer to wear them around my ears rather than in my ears just because I've got a tragus piercing that I'm trying to get to heal and my inny headphones weren't helping that at all, I don't think. Um, I've got a little to-do list that I've been working through for the weekend. I've got my wallet. This is my baby. I only got it for my birthday, which was a few weeks ago. Um, my two best friends bought it for me, and I basically told them what I wanted, and we went three ways because it was a little bit expensive. It's Chloe. I don't know if you can see. This is going to be backwards, um, probably, because I'm filming on my MacBook. But it's really cute. Um, I've got a Sharpie, or a fake Sharpie, but it's meant to be a Sharpie. got a hairbrush. This is a... Um, Mason Pearson company one. Uh, I had one, I think I, it lasted at least 15 years, um, which might be a bit gross, but I only just purchased a new one this year. Um, I love it. I'm still breaking it in. It's really sh sort of harsh on my head at the moment. My old one was so soft just because I'd had it for so long. Um, I've got a little sock that has my other camera in it. Um, I don't really use it that much. It's a Canon Ixus 8105. It's a good camera. Um, I only purchased this this year. Um, but yeah, I haven't used it that much, but I like to have it on me just in case. I don't know. Someone famous walks past. And, I don't know. Um, security pass for my work. Very exciting. A pen. I just bought this the other week for um, Daffodil Day. I don't know if you've got that overseas, but that is... Um, Cancer Council um, has a fundraising day once a year. You can buy daffodils or you can buy pens with daffodils. You can buy brooches, badges, all kinds of things. So I've decided to purchase that. Uh, my keys, very exciting. Um, yeah, I've got a Powerpuff Girl on there. I've had that. My three best friends and I had, well, sorry, my two best friends and I had one of these each. And I decided that I had to be this one because I was angry and this one seems to be angry. She's looking a little bit worse for wear. Keys, um, security key for my bank account. Very exciting. Um, hairband, hair clip. I don't think I've ever used this but I carry it with me just in case I decide to use it. Um, my, my iPod sort of fallen to the bottom of my bag because I tend to use my iPhone for music more than my iPod. I think that's the main compartment. There's a little compartment here. Dry shampoo. I don't think I've ever used this. I might have used it once, so I can't really recommend it. It's Chlorine. I'm dropping things. Now the front compartments. Okay. I've got a little pouch. 
and I sort of put all my loyalty cards and stuff in there and um, you know how you carry your little um, well, that's an example I suppose but you know when you get a certain amount of coffees you get one free so I've got a whole bunch of those for different places so I'll probably never finish any of them you know you feel like you should carry them just in case carry some wisps with me in case I don't know I end up crashing at someone's house and I don't have my toothbrush with me Zyrtex because I get allergies and this is the sort of the makeup pouch I've got some uh, Dior press powder exciting. I've got some Superstay uh, Maybelline concealer which is really quite good. I know people use it under their eyes. I find it's a little bit too much for putting under my eyes but I use it for blemishes. I bought actually bought this this week and I really really love it. Um, I think the brand's Shantakai um, and this is just a lipstick but it's quite um, it's quite sheer, it's not very opaque, but I really like it in it. I'll talk to you more about that in another video. Um, I have um, one of the new Lush lip scrubs. I've got the mint one, and I really like it, but I don't use it that much, but I like to carry it with me just in case. Um, I've got a little mirror from Red Earth. I've got this years ago. I think I actually got it in the UK at Space NK or something, but yeah, I find it's really useful. Um, Studio Sculpt Concealer and W15. I'm enjoying this stuff just because I've got so many blemishes at the moment. Um, this is one of the few things I find that conceals it properly. Um, I've got one of these Bourjois Night Repair Lip Balms, which I guess is a knockoff, sort of, or they're trying to be the by Terry Balm de Rose, so I can't afford $100 for a lip thing. I'd lip, I would love to, and, I, and seriously, I probably will end up buying it anyway. Um, on eBay for a little bit cheaper, but I bought this because it was um, $9 I think on Strawberry Net. Um, I don't really use it at night time, I more or less just use it during the day. Just to put on usually before I put a lipstick on or whatnot. A um, couple of bobby pins. Guys, we're almost there. Really sorry, this is taking a lot longer than expected. This isn't a very exciting. I've got a whole bag of bobby pins. I've got my old headphones, which I think I just carry with me just in case I decide to, um, I don't know, antibacterial sanitizer stuff, um, eye drops, and I think that that's pretty much it. Um, oh, some nail glue in case one of my, my nails come off because they ain't real. Probably be only used for the next 24 hours or so. It's gotten a few months use out of it. It's, um... It's been a good bag. Once the end, Suzanne, I don't know if it's overseas or not, but I don't know even know if they still have them in Australia still. But anyway, I hope you um, enjoyed that. I hope I wasn't too incredibly rambly. Um, I'll probably do an August favourites video and then I might just do some haul videos and we'll see where that takes us. Alright, thanks. Bye.